Well, in prior Classic Landscapings, Perry, we've talked about uh, the use of shrubs in your yard. And I think now that we're into the fall season, let's talk about shrubs and how color is important. Yeah, absolutely, Mike. We have spent some time talking about picking the right shrub for the right location, and that's always important. We want to make some decisions on fall color and things that really provide that different look as we head into the fall. Green is such a common color, and when they're aggressively growing, looks fantastic. But as we head into the fall, getting some colors like red and orange, we can make some really good choices in terms of shrubs and trees to really get that look looking well. Okay, here in the yard we do have a couple of uh, nice choices. Why don't we take a look at them? Yeah, this is actually red osier dogwood. It's going to get a little bit bigger, so you need to make sure you pick an area that's going to handle. It's going to get about 8 or 10 feet big. Um, it's good in somewhat shady locations or sun's okay. You can see it's actually going a really nice purpley red color. You can see it changing from the green. It offers a really attractive look and an easier grower in our climate. One of the other ones is like a dwarf wing burning bush which is, gets a real bright maraschino cherry red that's a very attractive color and something different that you can add to your yard. There's also other options of small cranberries and things if you have a tighter spot and you can't afford to have something grow so big. All right, some, uh, some good ideas for what to do with shrubs this time of the year. What about the endless summer hydrangea? That's coming up next on Classic Landscaping.